Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to modify wall type in Revit with sweep and reveal. Let's get started. Open up new architecture template. Click on architecture, wall, and wall architectural. So we could choose any one of this. So I'm going to choose brick on CMU. And what we're going to do is we're going to highlight this and edit type. And let's duplicate this. I'm going to rename it as brick with sweep and reveal and then press OK. So next thing is click edit and then because my preview is already open so if you guys started with this, just click preview. And then most of you guys have floor plan, uh, floor plan view. So just click this and you can modify it through section. Because once you click floor plan, this will be grayed out. So now let's create a reveal. Click add and then load profile. Let's go to profiles and then wall. And then as you can see, we have a reveal profile here open this up and then you can see there's different kinds of reveal and then we're just going to click one brick and then let's select from the top click apply and as you can see, it showed up at the top. So what we're going to do is we're going to put it down. So minus, let's say, 1,000. And then the offset around 100 and click apply. Press OK and then we could zoom in. So to, to edit that, you just need to click reveal again. I want to change the offset to probably 50 only and click apply. And then you can actually flip it or do setbacks. But we're just going to stick with this at the moment. You can also add more if you like. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to click reveal again. And then add more. So I'm going to select probably brick 2. And then from the top again, and put it in 1500. And then don't forget the minus. And then offset of 50 as well. And then the side is exterior. 
if you want it to be from the inside it's going to be interior so i'm just going to select exterior apply and press ok and as you can see this will be our reveal so the white part of this will be the void of the reveal so it will look like this so i wanted to show it to you from the 3d perspective and it looks like this so next let's select this again edit type and then now let's click edit again and sweep click add and then we should sell we should load a sweep so i'm gonna select this press open and then select that profile so wall sweep Let's start from the base and then the distance there. Let's have it as around a thousand. You can set the materials, but for now, I'm not going to set it. Offset, let's put 50 and click apply to see so we're probably just gonna put zero and then press ok so it will look like this and let's see it from the 3d view so a reveal is like a void and the sweep it's the profile so what if you wanted to create your own profile you can do so by by clicking file new and then family look for metric profile and click open and then select the line and then you could create your profile once you're happy with this you can load it you can save it first i'm gonna save it to my desktop And then I'm going to load it into the project. So now, let's go back to our 3D view. Click this. Edit type. Edit. And let's add another sweep. So Select add. So I just name it as family one. I want it to be from the base. And then the distance from the base. Let's have it as 3000. Click apply so that it show up. And as you can see, this is the one that we created earlier. Press OK, apply, and then OK again. And it will show up on your wall. So now when we go to level one and we click we click our wall, look for the the new type of wall that we created, brick with sweep and reveal 
and then now you can create your walls and the good thing about that is we just need to flip this for now and the good thing about this is you have your reveal and you have your sweep and when you when they hit their corner it will also be fixed and you can design your building faster thank you for watching and i hope you liked the video please hit like and subscribe feel free to comment down below